Question 15 just asks, what is the molar mass of sulfur dioxide? So to find the molar mass of sulfur dioxide, we would need the atomic masses of both sulfur and oxygen. So these values are just found on your periodic table. So molar mass of sulfur plus two times the molar mass of oxygen, since there are two atoms of oxygen and sulfur dioxide. So the molar mass of sulfur is 32.07 grams per mole. And the molar mass of oxygen is 15.99 grams per mole. Adding these values up, we end up getting 64.07 grams per mole for the molar mass of sulfur dioxide. So Junior Tutor said, in definition, the molar mass is the mass of a given chemical element or chemical compound in grams divided by the amount of substance in moles. Molar mass of a compound can be computed using a periodic table by adding the standard atomic masses of the individual atoms or elements. It is used to compute for the number of moles of a certain compound to give its mass. To compute for the molar mass of sulfur dioxide, we need to get first uh, the individual atomic masses of each element. Remember that for every one mole of SO2, there's one mole of sulfur and two moles of oxygen. Therefore, we need to multiply the atomic masses of sulfur and oxygen to 1 and 2, respectively. Atomic mass of sulfur is 32. Atomic mass of oxygen, 16. Solving for the molar mass of sulfur dioxide, they get 64.065 grams per mole. So this solution is correct. Okay, so I think we have time for one more question. Thank <phone rings> you.